Hello everyone. Welcome to Easy Olympiad Maths. Here I'm posting some questions from IMO Test Paper 2017 for class 5. Subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon to get notifications for new uploads. Let's start with our first question. Four poles are struck into the square ground of side 30 meter at the four corners. A rope fence is to be put around the poles. What length of the rope will be required for fencing? Now suppose the square ground of side 30 meter is as shown in the figure. See the figure. Now poles are struck at the four corners A, B, C and D of the square ground. Now rope fence is to be put around the poles that is around A, B, C and D. So length of the rope required for fencing is AB plus BC plus CD plus DA that is the sides of the square grounds and all the sides of square are equal so length of each side of the square ground is 30 meter so the length of the rope will be 30 meter plus 30 meter plus 30 meter plus 30 meter equals to 120 meter correct option is the next question is each floor of a high rise building is fitted with 20 doors there are 12 floors in each building there are 25 such buildings in a complex the total number of doors fitted in the complex is now suppose the building with 12 floors is as shown in the figure see the figure there are 12 floors in one building and 20 doors in each floor now each floor of the building is fitted with 20 doors so number of doors in 12 floors will be 12 into 20 equals to 240 so number of doors in one building is 240 now there's 25 such buildings in the complex so number of doors fitted in the complex equals to 25 into 240 equals to 6000 correct option is c sarveen used 4 by 9 of her money to buy four identical cups and three identical bowls she used one third of the remaining amount to buy six identical hairpins and two identical hair combs she had rupees 1330 left how much money did she have at first? Suppose the money Sarveen had at first is rupees X. She used 4 by 9 of her money to buy 4 identical cups and 3 identical bowls. 4 by 9 of her money is 4 by 9 X. So money left with her after buying 4 identical cups and 3 identical bowls is x minus 4 by 9 x equals to 9 x minus 4 x by 9 equals to 5 x by 9. Now she used one third of the remaining amount to buy 6 identical hairpins and 2 identical hair combs. Remaining amount is 5 by 9 x. So money spent by her is one third of 5 by 9 x or 1 by 3 into 5 by 9 x equals to 5 by 27 x. Now money left with her after buying 6 identical hairpins and 2 identical hair combs is 5 by 9 x minus 5 by 27 x equals to 15 x minus 5 x by 27 equals to 10 x by 27 now 10 by 27 x is equals to 1330 this is the money left with her x equals to 1330 into 27 by 10 equals to rupees 3591 correct option is a param mixes 1.45 kg of pink candy with 2.15 kg of orange candy and packs them 
in some boxes of equal weight if candies in each box weighs 0.18 kg how many boxes are packed by param now param mixes 1.45 kg of pink candy with 2.15 kg of orange candy total weight of candies equals to weight of pink candy plus weight of orange candy is equals to 1.45 kg plus 2.15 kg equals to 3.6 kg he packs them in some boxes of equal weight if candies in each box weighs 0.18 kg then number of boxes packed by param equals to total weight of candies divided by weight of candies in each box that is equals to 3.6 by 0.18 equals to 20 correct option is a prince has three strings string p is twice as long as string q string r is 4 by 5 as long as string p if string q is 14.25 cm then what is the total length of all the strings prince has now string p is twice as long as string q and string q is 14.25 cm then string p is equals to 2 into 14.25 cm equals to 28.5 cm now string r is 4 by 5 as long as string p so string r equals to 4 by 5 into 28.5 cm equals to 114 by 5 cm equals to 22.8 cm now total length of all the string is length of string p plus length of string q plus length of string r p is 28.5 cm plus q is 14.25 cm plus r is 22.8 cm equals to 65.55 cm correct option is d thanks for watching if the video is useful please like share and subscribe